Hey everyone, Aiden here. Uh, before I get started, I just want to let everyone know Mega Man 10 is going to be on hiatus for the time being. My my controller's messed up, but I'm I'll eventually have another one here within the next three to five weeks. I want to say could be wrong. Uh, I mean, hell, it could be sooner. So, instead of just going straight into the next difficult game that I had listed on that poll on Twitter some time back, I uh, figured might as well do some short games or some games that, you know, don't take me too long to play, maybe one, two sessions at most, until I get that. And uh, Super Mario Land was... My choice for this one. It's uh, one of the first regular Game Boy games, and it was made by Gunpei Yokoi and Nintendo, uh, as well as some of the other members of Nintendo's R&D One uh, division, which were not only the people behind the regular Game Boy, but uh, also the they're, they were responsible for uh, one of my all-time favorite Nintendo franchises, Metroid. So, yeah, it was it was interesting playing this as a kid growing up. But that's it, it's relatively short. We've got about sixteen uh, levels to go through. Nah, I'm not going in that. Screw that. Maybe in the next run through, but Mario, this this game is weird. Mario has to rescue, uh, go through 16 stages in order to rescue Princess Daisy. This is the first game she ever showed up in. We got little Goombas. Ah, get up there. I know there's a Power Star somewhere around here, or Starman, whatever they're called. Oh wait, that's right, it wasn't that, it was a 1-up! Ooh! We now have Power Balls. The only other power up in this game. I'm gonna... Ah, next, next Koopa I come across, I'm gonna... Go ahead and, uh, stomp, because, well... There's something special about the turtles in this game. Go away, you stupid fly guy. What? Ah. Or not. I guess I'm not going to be stomping any, uh... Any... Koopas for the duration of this Power Star, but that's fine. Get out of my way, you stupid flyman. Now, one of the cool things about the Powerball is, oh, if I can get it in there, come on. There we go. They can capture coins. Any coins they touch will be gathered from Mario. Oh, before I forget, uh... Refresh the sound alerts in case anyone uses them. There we go. I'm sorry if the game, uh, if the game audio is relatively soft or quiet. I just don't want to, uh, darn it. Oh well, got an extra light, that's fine. Uh, I just don't want to risk copyright on the music. As good as it is. Nope. None of that. But yeah. This time when you stomp a turtle or a Koopa. They explode. It's 
Same thankfully cannot be said of uh getting hit from below using a block or getting hit with a uh, super ball. So, yay. Whoa. Almost lost it. But I would have gotten it back. Now at the end of each stage, except for the fourth one of each world, that was unintentional. Uh, as you noticed in the previous stage, uh, it had two exits. One on top, one on bottom. The one on bottom is easier to get to, but, I mean, the, the one on top is harder to get to than the, uh, heart, uh, than the top one. But, uh, it rewards you for making it over to it by giving you a mini game where you can get either a Super Bowl power up or one to three lives. So, if you want, try and go for the top uh, route. Try, uh, try and challenge yourself. I may have been wrong. It might have been four, uh, three stages each world. But, Daisy, the princess of, uh, I think it was Sarasa Land. has been kidnapped by the alien Tatanga and for some reason it falls to Mario to well save the day beware of falling ceilings go away Super Bowl so I can shoot another one thank you not gonna be showing any of the secret stuff because well honestly I don't care about the secret stuff And if I get through this fast enough, then, well, I'll just, uh, go through again on the harder difficulty. Oops. Whoops. I forgot how janky the controls can be at times, but it's fine. I forgot how it looked on the Super Game Boy, like, holy hell. Though some of the colors do seem a little different from what I recall. Ah. There we go. It's all about getting out of angle? What the hell are you? Oh, the secret. The secret path. Which leads to this, and... Yeah. Um... Okay. That's cool. We'll just move right along. And yeah, we're getting a little low on time, but I don't care. All those coins and a and a uh, block, but I don't care. Only way to get down to there uh, is well is to uh, be regular Mario. Get out of here, you stupid lions. Boss time. Weak. And we're done with World 1. Already. Powerball is broken. Hello, Daisy.
but it's not really Daisy. Get out of here, you stupid fly guy. Ooh, three extra lives. That might be useful later on. Though we are on the normal mode, so it might not give me any difficulty. Love the peacefulness in this game, though. Oh yeah, by the way, power balls don't work on these. The oh. I mean super balls. Sorry. Uh, the only way to kill them is with the star. Whew! I almost lost my power ball. Oops. Okay, how'd I angle this? I want to say here. Almost. Nope, need to back up some. Come on. Ah. Oh. oh yeah, that's more like it. Okay, we'll move on. I don't really care about getting all those coins. I just wanted to see if I could do it. Because I hadn't done it in so long. I haven't played this game since... I don't even remember it when the last time I played this game was. Oh, is it here? Yes, it is. All right, seal horses are here now too. They take two or three uh, pow uh, uh blah blah super balls to destroy. Now don't let the uh, game fool you. We we are actually progressing. That's weird. Why isn't the what? No. Why is the Powerball not working anymore? Get out of here. Yeah, these falling blocks. You gotta be oh, really careful about them. Like, super freaking careful. Yeah, that's a thousand points, if at all. Don't know how I grabbed that, but okay. Will not question it. Though I kind of just did. <laughs> oh god, it's this again. Alright. Ooh. Too bad you can't rapid jump. Did not mean to shoot a powerball. Too far away or too close? Too, too close. Okay. Nope. There we go. Perfect shot. Oh my word. Oh sh! First death. There you go, just jump off there, buddy. Hey, I got 11 hits that time, uh, 11 coins that time, hell yeah. And I just got my extra life back. Get in there, Mario.
Get out of here, you stupid enemies. Be gone. And no, I don't remember how to get down there. I think I've only ever made it down there once. Oh, you cheeky freaking enemy. One of these was supposed to have a power ball, if I recall. Yep. Oh, well. I want my weapon back. My power up. Give me my power up. Oh, and of course, a seahorse. Get out of here. And you. All right. Do 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 do. Yeah. I need to remember not to hold the run button during times like these. Of course, not a single one. That's fine. I'll check this one out. Nope. Woohoo. I almost ran into that. Now, where was that bl hidden block? No. No. Was it here? Yep. There we go. Now, I don't recall what whether the music changes or not as it uh, ticks down below 100. I guess we'll find out. What? Oh, right. Falling blocks. No! Well, looks like we're taking the bottom path. Or bottom exit. That's fine. Oh well. Alright, the third stage of World 2 is underwater. I completely forgot about that. Come here. Ah! Stupid fish. That's right, get out of the way, you stupid things. Nope, you're not getting me. Squids might, but not you. But yeah, either the either A or B button will fire your torpedoes while on the stage. Woo. Okay. Well, that just confirmed whether or not they home in on your location or if they go up or down. So, yay. We'll just leave the octopus alone or squid, whatever he is. Could be this game's version of a blooper. But it's boss time. And luckily, he's easy. Just like that. They make such a weird sound whenever you hit them with the Power Ball. I mean, Super Ball and the, uh... Torpedoes. It's... But it is what it is. This next stage, though, is gonna start off making me wish I had the uh, Super Bowl power up. I'm not a fan of this world. Like, it's cool. Love the soundtrack, but Jesus. If it's the world, I think it is. No, it's not. Okay. I was thinking of the fourth one. Get out of here. Freaking Moai. One moment. Dropped my controller. Hopefully that doesn't impact it none. 
And I run right into the pit. <laughs> Okay. Doesn't seem to have, I just didn't account for input. No? There it is. Alright. Torpedoes. Let's just ignore those though. No. N nope. Okay, what about you? No? Okay. Well, that was simple enough. I guess the, uh... That enemy didn't want to spawn in the pipe anymore. Oh well. No biggie. That's the problem with the Moai heads. They don't know how to leave you alone. They will follow you until you kill them or they jump into a pit. But, oh well. Uh, okay. Stupid fr Whoa, I forgot about the running ones. Will you go away, you stupid freaking enemy? Where is it? I know there's another running one coming up. Where's my checkpoint? All the way back here, huh? Oh! Okay. Whoa! Back off, you stupid... Freaking enemies! Go away! Ah! Freaking A. Alright, where's my boulder? Ah. Such a unique stage design. I love it for that. For the longest time as a kid, I was afraid of these boulders. Like, I, I thought just touching them, like so, would, or just touching the top of them would kill me. But no, it's just touching the sides or the bottom of it. Come on now. Alright, where's it gonna spawn? I'll take this one. <sighs> I was really hoping it would give me a, uh... Mushroom, but eh, beggars can't be choosers. Just ride it to victory. There we go. Now let's see whether or not the the uh, Super Ball power up is a mu uh, is a mushroom. Now that we're regular Mario. <clears throat> no, it's a power ball. No. Oh well. It is what it is. Not that big a deal. Alright! Spiders! Get out of here. Okay. Nothing here. Or is there?
yeah, I'm kind of taking my time on purpose here. Oh, I almost jumped right into that freaking plant. That would have been rather disastrous for me, but humorous for the viewer, uh, for y'all watching. Come on, give me my power up. Don't put it over a pit. Come on, game. Oh shit. Oh, it gave me a mushroom just to take it away. But that's on me. I honestly wonder what this game would be like if it uh was ever like remastered. God, I forgot how many freaking spiders were in this level. Oh gods. Including the jumping kind. Well, on the bright side, at least, uh... At least the, uh... Wow, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, well. Just gotta keep moving. Whoa. Patient. Ah! It was just barely touched the edge of it. Oh well. Final stage of World 3. So it's not 16 stages, it's 12. Maybe 13. Ah! Okay, you can increase speed mid air. Interesting to know. Okay, I forgot about the boulders. Ho ho! Look at all these coins. Move to the right. Thank you, Mario. Holy crap. Okay. For those watching on Twitch, if there is anyone, I do apologize for the time that I'm streaming. Come on, there's got to be one up here. Oh, it's just the one up. Didn't mean it like that game, but thank you for the extra life. Whew. I almost run over the ledge. I wasn't even holding run. I'll try the upper path. Alright, what have we got in here this time? Ooh, more coins. Hey, don't slid over to the right. Come on now. Is that my, the only power up on the stage? Oh, there's the block. Okay. The timing of this. Oh, it gave me so much trouble as a kid. Boss time? I think it's boss time. Nope, not quite yet. 
Now, if you haven't caught into the theme, if memory serves, the boss is a giant Moai statue. So, yeah. Oh, it feels good to have that back. Yeah, no. You're not taking my power up away. Be gone, you stupid enemy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, it probably would have been easier and maybe quicker for me to go over to the right and just step on the plunger to kill it, but, meh. I'm not out all that upset about it. But on to the final world. Oh sure, now I land on the power ball. God, I love the stage music. Where is the enemy that I do not like? Here she comes. The Zhangxi. That is the only way to kill her. Uh, to kill that enemy, aside from the star power and making it jump into a cliff. Jumping on top of them will cause them to stop, but they're not dead. They'll get back up and continue hopping towards you. Ah, you know what? I'll demonstrate it here. Or not, because I off-screened her. Thank you, bullet. Thank you. That would have been rather humorous, I'm not gonna lie, I would have laughed so hard if I accidentally, uh, like, ran right into that freaking bullet from behind. Okay, where is that freaking pipe? Sam, you can't get rid of that enemy, huh? Oh well. Come on now. Was that 13 or 14? I may have miscounted. Nope. 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 Yeah. Okay. Stage music does speed up. And, and on this stage, I actually don't mind. Whoa. Sorry. 
Sounds pretty cool. Oh god! It is what it is. We're done with that stage. And three more extra lives. Cool. Let's see what kind of things this one has. I do believe this is when the game starts actually throwing all the enemy types. Oh god, it's the plants. No. No. I don't like those. They get in the way so much. Tango is really pulling out all the stops right now, though. Including these interesting-looking snakes. I don't... I don't even... I just... I don't... I don't know what to think there. At least it's not like a maze, uh, at least this area isn't maze-like, similar to the original Mario Brothers and Lost Levels. Or even some of the levels in 3. Now, if memory serves, there is... Is a little bit of a change to this in that uh, this stage has a boss as well as the next one but I could be think it, it could just be that there's a boss in the next one and then a boss right after that I don't rightly remember to be perfectly honest Odd. One of those uh, little fires aren't circling around that block. Or that one. What the hell? Uh, might be a hard mode type thing. I don't know. Oh, God. I almost didn't make that one. Okay, okay. And there goes my Powerball. Shit. Wait, am I back to regular Mario? Thought I was playing the American version, not the PAL. Yeah, that's right. Go away. Stupid snakes. Stupid, stupid snakes. Just run across those gaps. Whoa, okay. Uh, you weren't supposed to do that, but that's cool game. Thank you. Alright, 4-2 done. <clears throat> and yeah, I'm just taking my time to it. I don't... Power up. Yes! Fully powered. Oh no you don't, you stupid birds. Now where is that freaking star at? Oh you freaking game. No! Oh well. Yeah, that's why I just run right into me, you stupid enemies, I swear.
Oh, right. At this point, make sure you are staying up out. Oh, I hate the enemies in this stage. Um, stay as close to the front of the screen as you can because moments like just there. It's Well, more like moments like that right there and uh, we've got another one right here now do we have a third no if memory serves no we don't but we do have something like this Oh, right, Tatanga loves to have those there before his fight. Oh, wait, no, it's not Tatanga, it's the stupid cloud. All right, Tatanga, let's go. Now, he's not a... He's not something to... shake a fist at. He's freaking... Oh, you can destroy those. Cool. So apparently you can shoot a little bit faster if you, uh... I swear to God, Tatanga. Be gone. Alright, that's the first playthrough of the game. We're done. And because it took about 43 minutes... Once the credits are finished rolling, I'll take a short break and just go right into the hard mode. Now, can I control this? Nope. No, I cannot. Oh well. But yeah, Yokoi wanted to show off some of what this handheld could do. And I, I guess that's the reason why uh, Sugeru Marimoto let him do so. I don't rightly remember the reasoning behind it. But it is what it is. And honestly, a lot of people may not like this game. I still love it, even if it is via some of the rose tinted glasses at times. But, uh, yeah. If not for this game, we wouldn't have seen the likes of Super Mario Land 2, Six Golden Coins. Which, for us Americans, if memory serves, was the first time we ever got to see Wario. Which eventually led to the third Super Mario Land, Wario Land. And that eventually picked up traction to the point we got WarioWare. Alright, we're at that screen. Excellent. Yep, the credits were just as short as the game, for the most part. Uh, give me a moment, I will be back. Okay, let's get back to it. Time for hard mode. There's going to be some s slightly harder uh, navigation, maybe some due to tougher enemies along the way. Yeah, it's not too much harder though. At least not for the first couple of worlds. Ah! Stupid fly guy. Whew. 
<laughs> Alright, you gonna... Yep, that was gonna be our Powerball. Oh well. Give me my star. No? No star? What the hell are you doing up there? Oh God. Okay. Eh, not too bad for a first stage. Not too bad as far as hard mode goes. Oh, I forgot you could pause during that. And we got our, our uh, Super Bowl back. Nope. Trying to get rid of those guys as quickly as possible because, well, more enemies on screen means, well, more slowdown. And I kind of don't want that. Oh my god. Alright. Alright, what do we have? What do we have? Powerball! Don't know why it took so long for uh, that, but okay. Took me a moment before the speed actually kicked in. Okay, that was actually kind of cool. Didn't know I could bounce the freaking heart again. Oh, man. Eh, we got an extra life. That's fine. Let's continue on. See what this... Difficult, uh, this stage has in store for us. Eh, 12 coins, that's not bad. Now the question is, do the bosses take more hits? I don't think they do, but we'll find out. <laughs> I love unintentionally killing the enemy like that. I was just waiting for the freaking ball to just come back. Or go away so I can shoot another one. Oh god. I didn't see that pair up there. So many more lions, that's for sure. Now, how many more enemies until the boss? I think these are the last two. Yep. 
There we go. Yeah, he took about the same amount of hits. Maybe one or two more. At most. That's sad, but eh. This feels more appropriate in terms of difficulty, in my opinion. Especially now that I've gotten more, you know, used to platformers over the ages. Because back during this, t uh, back when I first played this game, I couldn't even beat more than one or two stages in the Mega Man games at the time. So, yeah. That's more of a jump and shoot style. Almost perfect. But we got the coins we wanted. So, wow. Nope, don't care. We're moving on. Woo! Give me that one up. Yes. All right. We're making pretty decent headway as far as hard mode goes. We're getting a surplus of these freaking power-ups as far as that goes. Just, wow, okay. Thanks for off screen yourself, I guess. Silly freaking enemy. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. I wonder how much further ahead that put us, honestly. Oh yeah, now at this point we get to uh, also... Fucking seahorse, I swear to god, man. We also get to contend with, uh, well... Seahorses over the water. Yay. I wasn't sure if I hit it when I bounced off the Goomba head, but that's fine. Hey, we reached the checkpoint at least. I want my one up. Or not one up, my mushroom. Thank you. Now we can get a move on. What? Really? Oh, I hit the hurt. I touched the freaking hurt box of the. Okay. That's fine. Not that big a deal. We just got our life back after all. Or the one that we lost. Okay, let's see if we make it this time. We made it! Yes! Hell yeah!
Too bad there's not a way to, uh, for those that have beaten the game once, don't have a, uh, a means of going back to the previous difficulty if they wanted. But I suppose it is what it is. Man, that star came early. Oh, God. Also, because you're just constantly moving forward, there is no means of turning around to shoot enemies that are coming at you from behind. actually made even easier in this difficulty. At least that's the way it felt to me, even though it had an extra orb. Maybe if it was a little desynced instead of right behind it. But nah. Could have just been lucky on it on when it started at the bottom of the screen. Oh well. On the, the Easter Island style level. At least I think of it as Easter Island. Powerball! Oh right, more of these enemies. Or of this enemy type. Ah, come on, game! Oh well. Oh! That happened! <laughs> Seventeen coins that time. Hell yes. Well, I did kind of mistime that. So that 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 is on me. Okay, that was 16, not 17. Well, gives me another chance to royally screw this up. Let's see how it goes. Also, you can't just jump higher off of an enemy. But it is what it is. It's really, really hoping for a, uh, ooh, extra life. <sighs> there we go. I don't want that thing following me if I can help it.
Okay. We're good. We're good. Ah. Okay, can't go up that way. Good to know. Get down here, you stupid moai. Ah! That's an interesting game though, like, the concept behind it all. Yeah, some of the mechanics are a little jank, but... I am... It makes for a really fun little platformer. I'm run- I've run out of things to talk about. So, I don't know what I want to say. Ho ho ho. So, I suppose my main question right now is, well... Will I run low on time again? On full one. When I reach it. Because it is guaranteed that I'll reach it. Like there's no doubt in my mind. So glad uh, that it didn't cause my hurt box to run into the hit box of that enemy. Of that uh, Koopa. Also, we get more of those uh, select eggs that like to fall down. Yeah, I'm not touching that, even if it's to see whether or not uh, just touching the top will cause me damage. Yep. Oh, I just gotta take things slowly. And of course, a torpedo, a uh, bullet bill. Ha! Can't get me now, can you, you stupid freaking enemy? Alright, where's the next freaking stalactite? I know there's gonna be one. Okay, maybe not. Ah, you can distinctly make them out. Oh, I forgot that was a secret. Wow, that was a lot of coins. I'm not even giving it the chance to spawn. Not if I can help it. Oh, I almost lost my weapon, or my power-up. And once again, we take the lower path on 3-2, but that eh, can't be helped. We got 16 lives. We're, we should be good. 
Right? <laughs> Alright. How about no game? I don't want to ride on the boulder. Not in that direction, anyways. Look how much quicker we get the coins. Really now. Oh, nice. All right, there were breakable ceilings up here. Let's see what's in them. Gladly take that one up. Thank you. Alright, that was the one I remember, as far as secret pipes go. Oosh! That's what happens when I don't think things slowly. Ah, eh, 15 that time. It's not bad. All things considered. But yeah, that's what happens if you are impatient. Or can happen. I completely forgot they had a boulder there. That's right, you stupid enemy. Just lay flat. And that's how you beat it without the Powerball. <laughs> Take some really precise timing and platforming there. Time to go take on the last two bosses, but we still got two more sta technically three more stages left to go through before we do so. Let's do this. Hey, good. We start the level with the Power Ball. I mean Super Ball. I keep doing it. What? Okay. Sometimes it just treats the coins as solid for some reason. There we go. Quit holding the run button, Aiden. Come on now. Maybe that pushed us forward? I'm not sure. Yeah, actually, I think it did.
None of that. Oh, you want to play, huh? Be gone, Jiangxi. Oh, that actually got a little too close for comfort. I suppose in hard mode, some of these plants just don't want to go away. That's right, give me that money. I had to stop. I had to stop just to keep myself from getting hit by that freaking bullet bill. Unintentional, but it worked. Really? One coin away? Oh, I almost jumped off to my death. enemy well that answered my question on whether or not we end up uh, at this point uh, for 4-1 and well we are imagine uh, Wonder if there was any intention to make it to where you gain points for enemies on the screen when you hit an exit. <clears throat> and it just wasn't added. For whatever reason. Snake. Goodbye, Snake. I'm surprised I didn't get hit there. Not gonna lie. So many enemies, look at this slowdown, like holy shit, man. So many power balls. I mean, super balls. Also, I like that you can fire them while crouching. Super useful. You know, it would be a dick move, but I think it would also be pretty badass if, uh... Can I... No. Okay. They are not affected by anything, much like in the original Mario Brothers. Good to know.
Be a good snake and go away. Thank you. Ah! Mistimed it. Is that there? No. Forward a little bit more. Maybe a little bit more? I don't want to get close to that thing and lose my freaking Super Bowl again. Not like last time. There we go. Wait, can I jump? Kinda. I can kinda jump and duck at the same time. Whoa. It looks so weird seeing Mario jump like that though. Okay, that was actually rather humorous. Not gonna lie. Oh! That tipped me up a bit. Was not expecting that at all. Alright, let's see if I can make it. I made it! I only missed one upper exit this time. But it is what it is. On to the final stage. And yeah, I'm expecting hell. I was wondering how long until those enemies showed up. Okay. Oh shit, you can destroy the mines. No. It's fine. It's fine. Being big doesn't actually change anything after all. Not in this dip uh not in this kind of mode. Go away, you freaking enemies. We're already near the boss. Oh, would you look at that? I got my life back. Screw you, game. Gotta keep going. We're so close to the boss. Oh, right, I forgot about those. Boss time. Oh, I'm ready for you this time, Tatanga. Let's go. And that boss before just... Yeah! Luckily, we don't have to hear the uh -uh, uh 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 type sound whenever we're hitting Tatanga, so there is that. Goodbye, Tatanga. We did it. Both runs of Super Mario Land finished. But yeah, 
with Daisy rescued. Mario is off to drop her off at her kingdom and uh, then go back home. Just, there's not much to the story. It's really simple in design. It's very similar to the original Super Mario Brothers. And I'm looking forward to eventually getting around to the sequels to this game. Including, uh, including Wario Land. I actually had a lot of fun growing up with that one. Oh my goodness. When I eventually get around to doing Super Mario Land 2, the six golden coins, it's going to be an interesting journey because I'm going to be going after every exit. It's going to be an all exits run. So, yeah. There's only one or two that I always have difficulty remembering. But other than that, it's a relatively straightforward one. And I'm going to be doing my best not to abuse a uh, couple of the power-ups. But with that, that is the end of Super Mario Land. And because we have beaten the game twice, we actually have a level select, which is pretty cool. <clears throat> but with all that said, thank you all so very much for watching. And until next time, y'all take care.